Welcome sa SIP9. This video, tutuloy natin yung ating series on calculus and dito sa video na ito pag-uusapan natin yung uh, limit of a constant function. No? So, a constant function is of the form y equals c, no? just to review, or f of x equals c, where c is any real number. So, for example, this uh, function, f of x equals 5, is a constant function. No? Now, ang gusto natin tignan, ano pa nangyayari if we take the limit of a certain uh, the limit of the constant of a constant function as x approaches a certain number for example here at x equals 2 diba sabi natin diba tinitingnan natin yung left hand limit at right hand limit for a limit to exist so for example dito sa given natin the limit of uh, the limit of f of x as x approaches 2 from the left no so from the left Kailan dito pa rin siya, no? Lahat yata ng value ay 5, di ba? So, 5 pa rin siya, no? So, the limit of f of x as x approaches 2 from the right is also 5, no? Pag dito ka, 5 pa rin kasi andun pa rin yung y value niya. So, meaning, since pareho yung uh, left-hand limit at right-hand limit, we have the limit of f of x. Or yung f of x natin, pwede na natin ilagay yung 5, no? Because they are equal. So, the limit of 5 as x approaches 2 is equal to 5, no? Ang kung titingnan natin yun in general, kahit ano yatang uh, constant function, no? For example, uh, ito ay f of x equals uh, two for, uh, 3, for example. If this is 3, palagi siyang 3 yung magiging sagot, no? At any number here kasi... Yun nga naman, yung lahat ng y value niya ay nandito lang naman. So, for x approaches uh, 2, for example, still the limit is 3. No? Kasi yung left hand at right hand limit niya ay 3. So, in general, if this is the function uh, f of x equals c, f of x equals c, and yung ano natin, yung x natin ay... Uh, Approaching a certain number, for example, a. No? Here, a is 2. No? So, ito general na ito. So, masasabi natin that the limit, that the limit of, that the limit of f of x, or the limit of c, no? the constant function c, as x approaches a, no? is equal to c. Kasi nandun nga naman, lahat ng, lahat ng value ng function nandito. So, kahit saan ka dito, ang, ang, ang uh, magiging value mo ay, the y-coordinate the y of this function which is equal to c. No? Kagaya nito, ang kanina, 5 ngayon, as x approaches uh, any value, for example, uh, this is 3, or maybe 1, as x approaches 1, f of x is 3, so the limit of f of x as x approaches 1 ay 3. So basically, ito yung pinaka-formula natin no, sa sa limit of a constant. So, just a few examples bago tayo magtapos. The limit of uh, 8, for example, as x approaches 3. So, ito pa rin yun, yung constant function na yun kasi ito naman palagi yung y value niya. Number 2, the limit of square root of 5 as x approaches uh, 6 still square root of 5 and c c square root of 5 square root of 5 so number 3 is the limit of um, pi pi is uh, 3.1416 and so on this number as x approaches negative 1 is still pi number itong pi ah yung number na alam natin yung 3.1416 Number four is the limit of uh, a negative 8.562 as x approaches uh, zero, still is negative 8.562. So I think maliwanag no, yung uh, rule na ganito, yung limit of a function as x approaches a, uh, the limit of the constant function c as x approaches a is equal to c. 
Okay, so yan lang yung ating uh, pag-aaralan ngayon. No? Gagamitin natin itong rule na ito every time na mag-compute tayo ng limit. So, be sure that uh, you learn it by heart. No? Maraming salamat. See you in the next tutorial.